G'day Scrappers, just doing a little scrap out today of uh, this giant Sony projector. Uh, this is one that I got from the museum and they said that uh, at the time it was uh, the most state-of-the-art projector. Uh, so it's a few years old now. It's um, obviously it's missing the lens and also the, the lens housing. Um, so we'll check it out and see how state of the art it is. <laughs> uh, I don't think scrap wise it there there really is much to it. But uh, so yeah. Uh, Still busy as usual, uh, doing little little pickups. Not a great deal. Um, I'd like to get more pickups, but uh, busy doing you know scrapping stuff around the place and processing a lot of uh, little bits and pieces that have been hanging around for a while. Okay, well, it looks like it's just going to be a whole heap of plastic and uh, I don't even think there's a DLP in these these ones, uh, just a regular projector. But I am going to have to start breaking it up a bit. Okay, so we just got a couple of fans here in this one, not a great deal. That might have done it. go all right here yeah, before I send this off for plastic recycling I've just got to remove this steel stuff and uh, she'll be good all right wow all right well there's a couple of boards up here there's a yeah it's just a power supply it will be interesting to see if there's a DLP. Uh, we'll check that out. There we have our power supply, so yeah, pretty big one. All right, oh, yeah, it's revealed a couple of more boards up here. Yeah, it's amazing how they, I mean, they put them together quite basically and uh, just amazing the uh, price compared to what we see as scrap, um, you know, or the components that is made up of uh, this. Basically, you're paying for the design and the technology the material value is very, very low. I suppose that's like 
pretty much every technology these days. Well, so far it's it's not a very complicated scrap. It's just sort of all coming apart quite easily. Quite straightforward. Nice set of gold pins in there. Cool. The thing with these uh, projectors, especially the older ones, they are really hard to sell these big ones. And especially if, if you're missing some components like uh, it, the, the lens housing, that's pretty important. And then the lens itself, well, you know they end up costing a lot of money uh, like five for this would be 500 at least if not more just for the lens you know and then you know so people don't generally buy second hand they're a bit like printers because they buy a lens and they've still got an old projector um, it doesn't take much more to uh, to actually buy just a brand new one with lens and warranty and everything. That's a quite a good board. Still got a little battery got to take out, but two nice BGAs. Little gold band crystal. Yeah, pretty good. Okay, here's our main board. Oh yeah, quite nice couple of really good BGAs here and a, a copper top one um, yeah be able to probably at least pinch one of these and uh, still get good mid-grade for it so I've got another little board here Uh, we just got a looks like a basic mid-grade board here still mounted got to remove all these things uh, okay and same on this side two of these little boards Pretty basic ones. Yeah, as for as big as it was, it's not so such a complicated scrap, which is good. Just gets rid of one big item in the yard, and okay. So yeah, just a uh, this one is barely a mid-grade board. Uh, yeah, usually this would probably be closer to a, 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 a low grade, you know, um, or a mid grade in the States, but not a peripheral.
lots of layers of stuff with plastic. So a lot of things to clean up in this scrap. Um, take off, you know, all the wire of these. This is just a low grade. Um, can always just take off this copper coil, unwind most of it. Uh, if you don't have anywhere to sell low grade. I think that's the main thing. Okay, so, all right, so in there, that little square lens, um, that's where the DLP would be. Don't think it's a DLP, uh, but we'll, this is, uh, at least we've got some aluminium. But just to make sure, I, I just, want to get uh, this opened up and have a look inside. Okay. Yeah, so, by the looks of it, it's not a DLP. Yeah, it's just a uh, totally different just a, a regular old school lens system, not the DLP. So you just got lenses and three sides here. Um, and yeah. Yep, this is definitely not a DLP. So, yep. No, nah, definitely not. There's a good chunk of uh, cast aluminium here, but instead of cleaning all this up, I might as well just throw it into Ironie Alley. So I'll get rid of that. And the chicken approves. Now this is all mostly just a plastic base and yeah all this here is a couple of power boards not a lot so this is one of those classic scraps where we take something with with little uh, value today but was probably worth four or five thousand dollars and we turn it into uh, in this case probably under ten dollars worth of scrap but that's that's e-waste I do have a subscriber gift um, I did get a couple of uh, Christmas cards from scrappers, uh, subscribers, and uh, also got a, what looks like a, a mug. So, okay, I'll just finish cleaning these off myself. This is just a couple of um, basic power boards, and the rest is one big chunk of plastic that I'll just take to my plastic recycler, and he'll shred it up. I'll just clean up some of the wire. Um, but yeah, that, that was interesting. Uh, nothing overly spectacular, that's for sure. I didn't expect anything. Um, I find it more worthwhile scrapping the small ones uh, if they got DLPs, because that's, that's all I want, the uh, DLP for gold recovery. But, hey, can't complain. It is what it is. Can always take this little board off here, throw that into mid grade and that into low grade. If you have someone that wants low grade, 
All right, well, that was a good catch up scrap video anyway. Uh, I want to scrap some more uh, interesting things. But, uh, well, I might as well unbox my little gift. Uh, I got this probably a couple of weeks ago. It's been just haven't got around to them. Hey, how's that? That's a nice little mug. That's Romantic. Romantic is also a scrapper on YouTube, so you might want to check him out. Um, yeah, actually quite a nice little mug, that. So thanks, Ro, um, for the gift. It wasn't needed, but, you know, nice nice to get gifts like that. Um, so he's an American scrapper. So check him out on YouTube if you want. Ro, R-O-E, and Mantic. Awesome. Thanks for that, buddy. Appreciate it. All right, well, there we go. Scrapped out a, a cup and a very high-end Sony projector, and that was okay. And, uh, yeah, I might clean all this up and look to uh, make another video of scrapping um, maybe some servers. All right, guys, keep scrapping, have fun, and I'll catch you in the next one.